hello guys so it is monday and so it's monday the 20th of june and it's been a little while since the vlog so i'm gonna try and do a weekly ish vlog for this week i have been doing some stuff because i'm actually going away next week i'm going to rome so that's gonna be really cool i'm gonna be taking this camera but i'm probably not gonna vlog just because it is a holiday and i just want to chill have some time to myself but i have been shopping this is one of my new vests that i got from super dry i'll get up and show you it properly that's what it looks like i quite like it because it's not like a super booby one but it still has kind of a slightly dipped hem i think is what you'd call it it's pretty cool pretty nice um, one of the other things I got when I went shopping is this, which is a new backpack. It is by Vans. I wanted a backpack and, yeah, I wanted a backpack for travelling, basically. So that's what I got. I got some of the tops and stuff like that. Didn't really go out to get much, just wanted t-shirts and vests in particular was what I wanted. Wanted some Topshop leggings. Would you believe the Topshop in the ball ring didn't even have a rail for normal leggings? I have a nose ring in today which i don't do very often because i find them a little weird this is like a rose gold one but basically my nose stud has been hurting me and i feel like it's kind of trying to reject and push it out i don't know what it's doing but either way it felt like really kind of bruised like where the piercing was which is so weird because i've had this piercing for about seven years since i was about 15. it's very odd very unusual I don't know why it would do that. If you do know why, please comment below and let me know. But it seems a lot better with this ring in, so I'm just going to leave this ring in for a little while. And I'm just about to do my hair. The weather in the UK is really bad. We keep having kind of floods-ish sort of thing. I'll kind of poke you out the window so you can see what I mean. So, like, it's not too bad here, but if you look here like i live in a cul-de-sac there's pretty bad the other day like all of this here was flooded it was really crazy really bad um i'm expecting a delivery from muscle food which hopefully comes because i want my protein bars i'm all out of the combat crunch ones that i normally have that i love i'm now on the grenade hype um i have one of these here which is the carb killer white chocolate cookie one which I haven't tried yet. I think I might try half of it and leave half of it for Liam. I'm not sure because he hasn't tried this one either. So I feel bad, you know, just trying it all and eating it all. Because he wants to try it too. And he prefers white chocolate more than I do. So yeah, I might just even leave that one for him and try a bite. Not even that good. I'm not, I'm not sure. Depends whether my carb killers turn up or not. Yeah, we'll just see what this week brings because I don't really know what's going on. I had a 10, sorry, I had an 8 a.m. gym session this morning with my PT and we did shoulders and back. It was really good, went really well. Really, really happy with it. So I'm really happy with my general progress as a whole and I'm trying to consciously kind of count my macros-ish. Kind of on a low carb setting at the minute. So we're seeing how it goes. So guys, I've done my hair. I actually am pretty happy with the way it came out. Because the last couple of times I tried to do my hair, like curl it, because I don't curl it so much anymore, it kind of just didn't hold any curl or really curl properly at all. But I was like, this time it's actually kind of worked. I think using a smaller barrel on my curling wand is probably the good idea. I used the Bellamy 6-in-1, which is like my favourite wand ever. This one. Uh, and I used the, let me just check, I used this barrel which is the 25, so second from biggest, but anyway I'm going to get ready, get my lunch out and head off, I think I'm also going to do me some BCAAs today because I need to recover my legs, are still hurting from Friday, that's how good or bad, how you may describe it. our session was on Friday. Did a joint PT session with Liam and my trainer, so first one together and it ruined us both. <laughs>
Wednesday and I'm just chilling at home at the minute so um, I have been doing some jobs around the house and whatnot, stuff like that. Now I'm stopping to have a snack, then I'm going to film some videos is the plan. I did do the earlier clips that I've just put music over. It's kind of like a mini haul from yesterday, I had some stuff come and I did go shopping a little bit for some makeup but I wasn't in a position where I could actually sit down and talk about it with you so I just thought I'd show you the products because I'd rather show you them than not show you them if you know what I'm saying. So yeah, I'm going to have some food here. This isn't what my lunch is, this is just a snack pre-filming snack and they are these they're so good I, I'm like obsessed with these at the minute I love them so I'm gonna have a few of those then I'm gonna have maybe some lunch if I'm still hungry and then I'm gonna get cracking on filming hi guys so it's a little bit later now in the day and I thought I would try these which I got yesterday which are the optimal nutrition amino energy supplement and i just opened up this supplement and it says it's meant to have 30 servings in here i don't know whether this is right or not because look at this look inside of here i've opened it and that's how much is in there but this was sealed so please leave me a comment if you guys know whether this is the right amount to be in here because if so why is this top so big i just don't understand it makes no sense this is the first thing I've tried by this company as well, so I really don't understand. I don't know what's going on. So guys, I've just finished filming and I just filmed this kind of look for you. And it was a first impressions with those new NYX, NYX products I got. And relatively happy with how it turned out. I haven't like edited it or anything yet, I've literally just filmed it. But we got it done, it's wrapped, done for the day, so that's one video done. Not sure if I'm going to do another one or not yet not 100 percent so we will see look at this carnage though carnage this is what happens when you live out of a makeup bag good morning guys so it is friday and i know it's been a day or two since the last vlog but you know how i am i'm getting really bad at this whole thing but i'm trying to get better i'm just getting ready to go to the gym as you can see I have a lot to do today, it is Friday, I go away on Tuesday, I have a lot to do, I need to do some packing, I need to do some um, packing because we're moving this stuff this weekend, so doing that. I also need to do some work online and stuff to do with businesses, I could do going to the studio and painting a little bit, so yeah I've got a lot to do, so let's crack on with the day shall we and let's see where it takes us. So guys, it is about 11 o'clock now, like 10 to 11, and I have been to the gym. Didn't have the greatest session, I was not feeling it today. Um, I'm feeling a bit weird today, I woke up feeling a bit weird. Um, so yeah, but I have a parcel here to open, so I'm going to open this up and we're going to have a look. Try on some clothes, and then we're going to get packing and crack on. So guys, this is top number one. It's just a plain top with some coloured bits on it and the logo. Just flip this around so you guys can see. I actually got this in a small. Um, I normally take a small in super dry, but I think I could have got away with an extra small. I'm not going to lie. But yeah, I don't know. It's a small, it fits. I feel like if I lose much more weight though, it might get a little bit baggy. There is a bit of chest room though, which is nice, so... Yeah, I feel like super dry tops fit quite nicely, so. So this is the second top, and this is actually a vest. I just wanted to get a plain khaki vest, and it has a little pocket here. The only thing is, it does make my boobs look really small, I think, but this is actually an extra small as well. My stomach is not doing good today, and my stomach looks okay when it's like out, but un like unclosed. Not looking good. But, yeah, so, pretty happy with that. That's an extra small. I'm glad I didn't get a small. Small would have been too big, definitely. And then the last thing was this v-neck top, which is a black v-neck with a pocket again. I just really like these sort of basic tops. And there's, like, something on my mirror that's really not nice. 
Um, but yes, yeah, so it's just a plain black one with the Super Dry logo stitched in at the bottom there. This one is a little baggier than the other ones. It's a different material as well, but this is probably the best fitting v-neck top I have found in a while. I'd prefer it to be a bit more like tight here, like that. But at least my boobs aren't hanging out. The problem you get with v-necks, you tend to get v-necks where it's too much of a v and your boobs just fall out, which is not appropriate. And they end up very bunched up here as well a lot of the time. This isn't too bad at all. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with these overall. This is a size extra small as well. So you guys can see for reference. And I am relatively busty, so for me to be able to fit into an extra small and super dry, I don't know. But I don't mind because it works for me. Probably wouldn't work for a lot of people though. bag to go to Liam's tomorrow well later today I've got this which is some of my on amino energy stuff um, because I'm feeling a little like blur at the minute so I think I need some energy to perk me up a little bit but I don't want to keep having like hands on monster and stuff all the time because that can't be good for me um, You know what, this is the orange cooler one and it's actually very palatable, I have to say. Because some stuff's not very nice, like my BCAAs I've got right now are not very nice. So I think I might have to look into on stuff a little bit more. Just because they have some really good flavours. So I packed my bag pretty much. Because we're moving my makeup, I actually think I'm going to take some of my more more precious my palettes that i'm slightly worried about traveling i think i'm gonna put these in this bag because it's got all clothes padded around it so that's what i'm gonna do now sadly the back like the box with all my makeup is actually in the garage so i have to go in there and do it but it'll be worth it because i don't really want them broken so Also, am I a crazy lady? Honestly, guys, am I crazy for doing this? Ew. I think that's pretty much it. I mean, I should probably take this one because this is like you can't really get these anymore, can you? So, I should probably look after you a little bit more, guys. Um, and out of this lot, is there anything in particular? Um, Dallas, maybe. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, you can come with me too. Mr. Niles, you can come with me too. Dallas, my Mac Melba blush, and. That. So that's all I'm going to be taking in this bag. Also have a bag of food to take home as well. Found this loaf yesterday. Oodies, gluten free, tiger bloomer, incredible, and it's dairy free too. Incredible, incredible loaf. Like if you guys are looking for gluten free bread, this is your one. Then we have some bagels. We have some other stuff in here as well, but I won't go into detail. I have this to take with me also.
guys, I've been through and emptied out my drawers and stuff. Everything's emptied out, ready to go. I've packed some more stuff for holiday. That's stuff that I need to put on eBay that I want to get rid of. And that's as much as I can do for now, I think. So guys, I'm home now and I'm just going to chill for the rest of the evening. I would vlog, but I'm not going to be doing a lot. I've still got some work to do, but I'm going to crack on with that now and get that done. Then I can chill. And then technically, other than going to work Saturday night to photograph, I consider myself on holiday so yeah well then Monday will be holiday prep day but that is pretty much how I'm playing this so technically I'm on holiday ish now yes and I might do a little vlog of holiday I'm not sure I'm not sure yet guys it's my first holiday with Liam so I would rather probably just have a holiday have a break there will be pictures and stuff though so if you guys should follow me on like instagram or anywhere else snapchat whatever and they're always linked down below if you want to check those out and add me on those and follow me and whatnot so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog i know it was a lot of like music over stuff but that's how my week's been and i will see you all soon Put the guns. We'll see you all soon with another video. Until then, guys, if you haven't already liked and subscribed, please do so. And I'll see you then. Bye.